Good afternoon, dear viewers. I am happy to welcome you on Sovelmash channel. Today is day 309 since mounting of metal construction started. And today is the start of a new stage in construction of the Design and Technological Bureau. They started work with external utility systems. In particular, disassembling of plates of the temporary road on the left side of the building. It is necessary for the builders to start placing utility lines there in the future, which will be accompanied with a lot of groundwork. You can now see unloading of pipes, reinforced concrete structures and wells from a truck. These materials will be used for making utility lines in the future. There, where the truck is being unloaded now, there used to be a heating unit. It heated the warehouse part of the Design and Technological Bureau. Recently the temperature has been consistently above zero. Heating of the building is no more needed. That is why the unit was disassembled. Work continues on mounting enclosing structures that is, casing of the external part of walls. Work continues, which requires a lot of manpower. External casing is placed on the interior part of the ramp canopy. And now let's look at what is going on inside the building. Well, it's not the end of this video. You know, the phrase that there has been a lot of work done and a lot of tasks are being performed at the same time, they are not just empty words. We are now in the place that many viewers are familiar with. This is the warehouse part of the Design and Technological Bureau and work here continues. This work precedes pouring of a new fragment of concrete foundation. You know, in this video we will try to show to you how much work is being done at the same time, simultaneously. And in this video we will try to show you new angles, new ways, new angles that our camera lenses never captured before. Let's try to do it. of stairs where so much cameramen have never been before. Please come in. Work is in full swing here. Here you see these supports. After steps were poured, almost all foam work has been demounted and these structures are left here for builders to continue work which needs to be done. There you see window frames which have been installed and now let's go up a little bit higher. Look. There is unloading now of what was brought on the construction site today, what we showed to you earlier. And we need to go higher. Here you see the support This construction was necessary. After steps were poured, after flights were poured, concrete was getting more and more firm and this construction allows to do it in as safe a manner as possible. And now we will get to the mezzanine of the first floor. Let's do it. Earlier we showed these mezzanines to you, however access here was only possible by temporary stairs and it was not as convenient as it is now. Please look, most of anti-fire treatment has been completed, the remaining interwall partitions are being mounted or rather frames that interwall partitions will be fixed to. And now enjoy the view. Now we will 
ask our cameraman to get from this part of the mezzanine to the other one. And together we will look through the eyes of the camera how much time it will take, even if it is in the accelerated mode. And now you see the point which is quite far away. That's me there, quite far away, I'm waving. And I'm actually on the initial spot. Well, this allows us to estimate the size of what is being constructed here. And as tradition of this video demands, we will try to show you another flight of stairs where no cameraman has been yet, and actually no one except for the builders. It is not really used daily, but we got permission to get here. We will now show you what is going on there. It is easier for me to do it. The cameraman has more difficulty in doing so, but still I think that we will do it. We are getting even higher now. And here, here, it is like an impasse, walls, we are stuck between the walls. Let's go find out what is there, which floor we are on, where we are, let's go. As you see, the picture of what is happening on the second floor of the Design and Technological Bureau is changing a lot. There are more and more interwall partitions, separate offices are being made, separate workshops, equipment which was brought on the second floor in big quantities is already distributed in different rooms and you can't actually see it. And you can get lost now on the second floor if you don't understand the layout of the building. And it makes us really happy because we can see progress there. Look at how many people are working on the construction site. There is work on the second floor, on both sides of the building, on the roof, inside the building, on the ground floor. They are working on compacting ground, on preparing for concrete foundation. They are unloading pipes, reinforced concrete structures, wells, and many other things. And today is Tuesday, the big meeting day, when the general contractor, subcontractors and the client are all on the construction site. This day can be surely called the day of the start of a new stage in construction of the Design and Technological Bureau Savalmaj. Make sure to subscribe to our social networks. Like and comment our videos, click on the bell button. Share the videos with everyone who is interested in the Savalmaj project. See you soon, dear viewers.